Hello everybody, this is iPod Touch Baller, and today I'll be actually making my first real tutorial in a while, and it will be on how to downgrade from firmware version 2.0 down to firmware version 1.1.4. As you see right now, I'm on a firmware version 2.0, as you can see from the App Store, and I'll show you in my settings real quick. It's also a little bit of brightness. General, you see the settings are kind of different. I can't lower the brightness anymore. Uh, about, and you'll see if you can really read that. Version 2.0. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to change that. I'm just going to show you how to restore your iPod back into 1.1.4. Note that this will take a long time, so I suggest either using an older computer in which you do not need the newest version of iTunes on, that's what I'm doing. So this is what I use for my iTunes, and I'll be using this one for what I'm doing today. I'll be downgrading to um, iTunes 7.5, because that's what you'll need. You need the 7.5 version of iTunes, and also a restore file for 1.1.4. So, yeah, let's get started. I'm going to switch to my screen recorder, so we can start doing everything that we need to do on the screen. Okay guys, and now we're on my screen. Um, so what we're going to need to do is an uninstall iTunes and then install version 7.5. So the first thing we need to do is uninstall. So we go to Start, Control Panel, Add or Remove Programs. You see right here. And you need to locate iTunes right here and just hit the Remove button. I've already done this, and this is an older version, so just hit remove. It'll prompt you, just go through the uninstallation process, and then restart your computer. Then you will need to go through the installation product process of the iTunes 7.5. I will have a link to that in the description, along with most likely a link to the firmware. And once that is done, once you have installed the new one and everything, you will get a pop-up saying that it will not open because the library was made with an earlier version. What you need to do if you get that is go to Start, My Music, iTunes, and this file right here, right click on it, rename, and just name it anything. And exit out, but um, yeah, mine can stay that. that at that so it doesn't mess anything up. Now, um, once you have the new ver that actually I'm saying new version, once you have the old version of iTunes installed, we're going to need to do something on, my, on your iPod. So if you give, give me a second, I will switch back to the iPod. Alright, um, I forgot something before. Um, when you downgrade and you plug in your iPod to iTunes, it should come up with something like this. The iPod, Philips iPod, or whatever the name yours is, cannot be used because it requires iTunes version 7.7 .7 or later. That is because we are still running the 2.0 firmware. So we're going to have to change that, aren't we? So what we need to do now is put it into DFU mode by powering it off normally. Make sure it's plugged in. And hold down power button and the home button for 10 seconds. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. After that, let go of the power button, but keep holding the home button until your computer makes the sound that it does when you have a new found hardware. Like that. That just made it, but it's in my headphones. But, um, and it should come up with a thing that says it's in recovery mode. So I will get, I will change back to my um, screen now. Got this All right, error message. The iTunes has been detected in recovery mode. You must restore it in iTunes, restore this iPod before it can be used by iTunes. So press hit OK and shift click restore. This, then you'll need to uh, uh, get that um, iTunes, that uh, folder. Hold up. Uh, you'll need to get your firmware, your 2.0 firmware. 
just scroll until you find it. I have it saved like 10 times for some reason. Okay, here it is. There is iPod 1.1.4 store open. And just let it go. It will restore your iPod into 1.1.4. And when mine is powering on after the restore, I will change back to my camera so you can see that. And also, I want a little bit of feedback. How do you, how do you like the screen recording and camera mix? Do you like that, or do you want me just to do like just the camera or just the screen record for tutorials? Please leave a comment down there in the description, which will be the way that my mouse is going down there. So uh, yeah, and I also, since I'm making a video, I want to thank everybody for my support. I have 361 subscribers, and something that I love. I want to thank you guys a lot for this. My total video views. All right, 103,213, which is huge. I want to thank you guys so much for all the support that you've been giving me the time that I was here. And I don't see myself leaving anytime soon. Oh, I got a friend invite. I forgot about that. Oh, so, but, uh, yeah, I don't see myself um, leaving. So I'm going to switch back to my camera because it just started coming back on. All right, so as you see here, it is still doing its little thing. If you could see it, it has the Apple logo and the little spinny balls down there, but you can barely see it. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's going to be restoring into 1.1.4, as you see here. So I will be right back when it is done restoring into firmware 1.1.4. Okay, so my iPod is turning back on, and on iTunes it says it has been restored. Oh, it just went away. And saying it was been restored no, to a factory settings and all that stuff. But yeah, it is turning back on now. And wait for it. We have firmware version 1.1.4. Now, hold on a second. I will show it to you. General about and I think you can see that I'm just going to focus it a little bit better firmware version 1.1.4 so that is how you successfully downgrade from 2.0 to 1.1.4 the only reason that you probably want to do this is if you want a um to continue with your jailbreak um but 2.0 has a lot to offer I'd give it a little bit more of a chance than that so yeah, that is it. Comment, rate, subscribe, and uh, oh, somebody asked me, um, what do I use to record my videos? I use um, debut video recorder. Oh, hold up. Oh yeah, debut video recorder. And that's how I do the screen too. Snapshots, I can take pictures, um, different stuff like that. It's pretty cool. So yeah, uh, comment, rate, subscribe later 1.1.4